Hi, Gloria Hoffman here with the Simply Fit Board. Now we are going to get into the pull day workout. This is where you take your uh, dumbbells or your weights and you're going to pull those muscles and contract those muscles. But first, let's always warm up with two minutes of the basic twist. And as always, make sure you warm up slow. Get those muscles working. We don't want you to get hurt. We want you to warm up those back muscles, leg muscles, that core, those core muscles. This basic twist in and of itself is going to give you a full body workout, especially if you're holding weights like we all are. Um, this is the beautiful Andrea and Kelly is with us. The handsome Kelly, I should say. <laughs> They're working out with us today and I know we all have different size hand weights and that's okay. If you wanna start out with two pound hand weights, that's fine. Today I'm working out with five pounds just to get a little more burn and to work that upper back and those biceps just a little more. But it's totally up to you. A lot of people do the basic twist with no weights at all and that's fine as well. You're still working every muscle in your core just with this one move. And of course, balancing the entire time. You're improving your balance and working all of those stabilizing muscles, the ankles, the knees, the hips, the lower back, the upper back. You're just getting so many benefits with this one move. So don't take it lightly. Once you get warmed up, we're one minute into it, so you should be a little more warmed up. You can go a little more intense and a little more aggressive. The more you get that board twisting around, the more you're gonna feel it in those abs. And I like to flex them as I do that as well to really, really maximize the benefits while we're warming up in this two minutes. Remember, this is only a 10 minute workout, so we gotta do as much as we can to get that heart rate up to burn as many calories as we can in this short period of time. It may hurt, but it's only 10 minutes long. So try to push yourself as we're going through this. If you get tired, you can always drop the, the dumbbells, kind of slow it up, but you can see my heart rate is already going up. I'm getting steps on my fitness tracker. Any fitness tracker you have will track those steps. So we're almost done. Just a few more minutes in the basic twist and we're gonna start right in with hammer curls. Five, four, three, two, and one into hammer curls. Now the difference is you're gonna wanna keep your dumbbells straight. Bring those up. Three, four, we're gonna do eight of these. Five, six, seven, and eight. We're gonna go into bent over rows. Now with these, keep your dumbbells right in front of you and you're gonna go straight up and pull those back up, those shoulder blades together. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and we're gonna go into reverse butterflies. Same thing, keep your dumbbells out in front of you and go wide. This is really gonna work that upper back. Three, we're gonna do eight of these, four, Five, you can see on Kelly, he's really pinching those shoulder blades together. Seven and eight. Now we're gonna go into deadlifts. Deadlifts, I must admit, are one of my favorites. They not only work the lower back, but you're gonna work those glutes and hamstrings as well. There's one. The key is make sure you thrust your hip forward as you come up to really get the benefits in that glute and hamstring area. We've got five, six, seven, and eight. Back into one minute of the basic twist. That was our circuit. We're just gonna repeat that two more times. In that one circuit, you worked your biceps, you worked your upper back, your triceps, your, your upper back again, and shoulders, and your, of course, your lower back, glutes and hamstrings with those deadlifts. Those are one of my favorites. So just make sure when you're doing all of the exercises, you're doing them properly. You should fill them in the parts that I'm pointing out, that upper back shoulder blade area as you're doing them. During this one minute twist, we want you to really push it and work your heart rate up. This is where you're burning those calories and getting that cardio workout in, which is so good for your heart. You're working that heart muscle. You guys smiling still? <laughs> And if you, you know, have to get off or take a, a break or readjust, totally fine. Just get back on as soon as you can and keep going. This board is for everyone. You got five more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Back into hammer curls. One. Now if you want, you can turn these into lateral curls where you just face them out a little bit more to the side. Six, seven, and eight into the bent over rows. Once again, hang them and then pull them back 
Keep your shoulders back, your back straight. There's three, four. You can do it. This is, you're doing balance as well as working the upper back and shoulders. Seven and eight into reverse flies. One, two. Now with this one, I'm gonna show you on Andrea here. She's keeping her back straight. She's really, really pinching those shoulder blades together, which is really gonna give that maximum benefit. I think we got six, seven, and eight into deadlifts. I like to keep a slight bend in my knees. Remember, as you come up, thrust that hip forward to really get that benefit in those glutes and hamstrings. You're gonna keep your back straight. Five, six, just a couple more, guys. You're doing good. And eight, back into one minute of the basic twist. Now, that is why you lose so much weight with the Simply Fit Board, it's because you're keeping your heart rate up the entire time. I know I used to go to the gym and do what we called circuit training, and we would do our bicep curls, and then in between them, you just stand there, right? And your heart rate drops all the way down, and you're losing all of that time when you could be twisting on your Simply Fit Board and burning those calories and burning that fat and utilizing that one minute break or 30 second break. Like I said, if you really wanna push it, you can do some of the hip training that we talked about in the first video. Or if you need a break, you can at this point take a break, get some water or drop your uh, hand weights down like I am and just twist a little slower. Give yourself a chance to catch that breath again. Are you doing okay? <laughs> Scooting over here. <laughs> All right, just a few more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and we're gonna go into our last set of hammer curls right here. Eight, seven, six, these are working your biceps. So really go slow and smooth. You don't wanna swing them. Seven and eight. Now into bent over rows once again. Triceps and that upper back and those shoulders. Keep your back straight. Pinch those shoulder blades together. And you got five, six, just a couple more into reverse flies. Now here, my legs start to shake because you're really having to balance because you're bent over. Four, five, it's a good thing though. <laughs> Seven, and last one, deadlifts. Here we go. One, two, after this, we're gonna go into our cool down, guys. We are almost done. That was 10 minutes, it went by fast, but you work so many muscles in your body. Seven and eight. Good job, guys. One minute twist to cool down. If you want to really push it in this one minute to maximize your calorie burn, that's fine. If you wanna kind of really Go slow and get that heart rate back down before you start your day. That's great. I actually like to work out at night after my kids go to sleep. It's just so fun to get on the board when it's quiet in the house and I get to watch my reality TV shows and twist away. It's quiet so it doesn't wake them up. But I'm still getting that calorie burn in 10 minutes a day. I mean, that is incredible. Sometimes I'll start my day off with the 10 minute workout with one of our other 10 minute workouts and just work extra muscles in the body, incorporate in the glute or the ab workout with this pull day, and you're maximizing your benefits. So, if you can see my heart rate, how are you guys doing? Did good. you hang in there? <laughs> Sweating. And you guys are doing good. This is just our first step. Push yourself. We only got five seconds left. Four, three, two, and one. Pull day is over. Good job, guys. And like I said, you are now on your way to becoming Simply Fit.